cutting out inflammation. The standard American diet, um, I really hate to say this, but it is probably the worst diet on the planet for people in developed nations because it can make us so incredibly unhealthy, causing all of the blood sugar swings because of the processed foods. But a great place to start is focused on food sensitivity elimination. This is why I oftentimes recommend for people with Hashimoto's and hypothyroidism to go gluten, dairy, and soy-free because these are the most common inflammatory foods in Hashimoto's. And just removing them from your body is going to lower that inflammation signal, and that's going to allow your body to heal. When we've been under stress for a really, really long time, we can become depleted in some of the nutrients that are required for a proper stress response. The two biggest ones are going to be vitamin C and magnesium, but also the B vitamins, especially P5P, which is the active version of vitamin B6. 